Hello, congratulations on purchasing your Prime Rotisserie Grill and Barbecue. This is the instructional video that'll guide you through the simple steps of assembly, use and maintenance. Be sure to watch the entire video first and follow along in your manual before you attempt to put it together by yourself. We also recommend that you have a partner to assist you as the grill is a bit heavy. Please assemble on a soft flooring material to avoid scratches and other damages to the products. All the loose parts needed are provided in your box. The only thing you need is a Phillips screwdriver. First, let's go through your component list. You should have the following parts in your box. One main lid and one handle bracket. One handle spring, one handle bolt and nut. Four ventilation doors. One main body and two folding shelf brackets. One front panel, two right legs and two left legs. One bottom shelf, one wheel shaft and two wheels two cotter pins, two main lid hangers, one top shelf, two small shelves, one for the right and one for the left, one ashtray, one charcoal tray and two charcoal tray hangers, two steak trays, skewer bag including 18 skewers, one monkey wrench, one pair of iron tongs. You should have 50 bolts, eight nuts, and 10 washers. Before you begin, make sure you read the assembly instructions on page seven of your manual. Let's begin. It may seem like a lot of work, but if you follow these 20 simple steps, you'll be barbecuing in no time. Step one and two. Attach the handle bracket to the lid with a bolt, washer, and nut. Then attach the handle spring, bolt, and nut to the handle bracket like this. Step three. Attach the ventilation door to the smoke outlet on both sides of the lid with a bolt, washer, and nut. Do not make it too tight so it opens and closes easily. Step four. Now attach the ventilation doors on both sides of the main body like this, with the washer and nut. For steps five and six, attach the folding shelf bracket on the left side of the main body with six bolts. Then simply insert the front panel onto the main body. Step seven, fix the front panel on the right and left side of the main body using four bolts on the left side and four bolts on the right. Steps eight and nine, now for the tricky part. Turn the body upside down. Be careful not to damage the on and off switch and attach the legs. Short legs on the left and long legs on the right. For this, you should use eight bolts in total, two for each leg. Step 10, fix the bottom shelf and attach it to the legs with four bolts. Steps 11 and 12, insert the wheel set through the short legs like this. When you insert the wheel, place one washer on each side of the wheel. Then, insert the cotter pin into the groove so that the wheel cannot drift away. Step 13. Now you can turn your grill over to make it stand upright again. Attach the main lid hanger on the right and left side of the grill with a bolt, washer, and nut like this. Make sure the nut is not too tight so the hanger can move with ease. Step 14. Insert the lid hanger to the right and left hole, as you can see here, and close it carefully. Step 15, almost there. Well, you've done the hardest part. Now the rest is easy. Simply assemble the main body cover to the hinges at the back side of the grill using four bolts. Step 16, now place each shelf in the folding brackets on the right and left side of the grill and attach with six bolts. Step 17 and 18, for these steps, insert the top shelf into the main body and main lid hole like this and insert the ashtray. Step 19 and 20. Hang the ashtray hanger on the ashtray. Pull it into the inner grill and hang it on the hole. So when you're putting the charcoal inside, take the ashtray out first, put charcoal in the tray, and then pull it into the inner grill. And finally, attach the grill. Congratulations. You've successfully assembled your prime rotisserie grill and barbecue. Here are just a few notes about the battery before you begin using your product. This rotating barbecue grill works on 9 volts of power. It takes 6 C LR14 batteries or an external power adapter of 12 volts. Please note that the batteries and adapter are not included. You can open up the battery holder by untightening and sliding the door open like this. Place the battery holder inside, insert the jack to the power terminal, turn on the power switch and check the status of the rotating. If the grill does not rotate, the batteries or jack may not be inserted properly. 
Once rotation is smooth, you can close the power door and begin grilling. Safety is always important when using your grill. Make sure that the skewers are always inserted correctly before closing the lid. Remember to check your temperature gauge regularly and never let it go above 180 degrees. Keep the lid closed when cooking to save on cooking time and distribute the heat evenly. You'll notice that your charcoal tray has three levels. We recommend using the third level for skewers and the second level for steaks. And be sure to use gloves when adjusting the heat control door and the charcoal tray level to avoid accidents. Check your manual regularly for useful safety and maintenance tips. Thank you for using Prime Rotisserie Grill. You're going to have so many fun family times and great tasting healthy meals. After all, that's what barbecue is all about. For more details, please visit our website at www.primegrill.net.